So, while it looks complicated, it's actually pretty simple. It's a closed loop system, as it's called, which means that it starts and ends in the same place. This is the solvent tank. This is where all the hydrocarbons, the butane and propane, uh, are stored. So they're stored in here and chilled down to cryogenic temperatures. From there, it's passed through this tube here into the material column, as it's called, whether it's trim or nug. So this is where the weed is stored. And all the solvent gets passed through this hose into this vessel. Well, and it slowly travels through all the material, soaking it. And as soon as the solvent passes over it, it's basically picking up all of those compounds along the way. And by the time it passes through here, all the weed is left behind with no more of the good stuff. It then goes through another hose line into this column. This column is known as the de-wax column. And this is where you separate all of the fats or lipids from the plant. You purify it down uh, one step after the other. From there, that solvent contains now the active ingredient we're trying to extract. We pass it into this collection pot. But instead of cooling this one, we apply light heat with just a little bit of water. And that, what that does is it boils off all those solvents that were used to extract the product, leaving behind the product. So it's like a double boiler. It is just a distillation. What's left over in the bottom of this vessel is your concentrate, and then all of the solvent gets passed through this other line in the back, right back into where it started. That's closing the loop.